Good. Hold on. That's not the one I want. Donation ticker. Yep. Pull that back up. Pull the lead box back up. Ah, let's drop the TV volume. And open the chat. Hi, little cat. How you doing today? I'm gonna need you to move your little butt. I'm sorry. I didn't want to smush you. You little shit. Oh, there we go. Resident Evil. I need to reassign the slots. I think it was alone in the dark. Yeah, I think it was alone in the dark. Hold on. No, it was not. What are you doing, cat? Ah, could it be RE1? All right, come on. Go on out. Goodbye, cat. You weird little fuck. <laughs> no. Didn't that the one I just loaded? Put you for slot one then? Oh, I kept loading memory card. Was this it? Yeah, this was it. Okay, close that out, close that out. I should probably tell Dibs. Oh, hey, who's here? Hey, Snappy. Well, glad to see you. And yeah, we're getting close. Thanks for the GG, mate. There we go. Open up the Twitch chat on my phone. Now we got that up. Ah, there. But either way, thanks for popping in. Have a good day. Almost lost track of the uh, controller. Don't need this. Might be good to have that. Do we need anything else? No? Let's roll. Let's go deal with bitch ass Birkin. Should be easy enough. 
The solution is just to shoot him until he dies. Fascinating, I know. Sweet tea. Oh, the motor stopped due to overheating. Lovely. Welcome back. Uh, Gotta shave after the stream. My face is hey, annoying. take it easy. We're Fucking inside hate. Umbrella's secret lab. Fucking I'll go the find the something to treat that wound. So just rest here in the meantime. But I'll only slow you down with these injuries. Go. Save yourself. Is it just me, or does everybody always ignore what I say? I told you, it's my job to look after you. But you'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time, but I really enjoy being with you. I... I know I'm not capable of caring about anyone, but I don't want to lose you. If you weren't capable of caring, then you wouldn't have just said that. I'll be right back. Ah, 
don't worry about it, Leon. You wouldn't have been able to make it back to the train anyways. It fell through the damn roof. What are you gonna do? Drag boxes from all, all the way across the facility? Just go full out shotgun. Don't need the handgun. Magnum's overkill. guy we don't need to deal with. Oh, he ain't a zombie, but... If I don't need to deal with him, mean, we don't need to go grab his note. Probably will do it anyways, just because I usually do. Come on, push. Push faster. Yep, I hear him going. Get out of the stun lock because he got pushed so far away that some of the bullets didn't hit him. That's annoying. Oh well, he's dead now. Game loves putting liquors in your path. This in this phase of the game, it's pretty much zombies, plants, and liquors. Loaded for, be loaded for, what's it, bear? Yeah. Loaded for, I can't fucking remember the phrase. I think it's loaded for bear. We got a lot of shit for him. Well, no way, I can do so well on boss fights, but when it comes to, uh, what's it 
doesn't drop a liquor. That one drops Mr. X. Got about that one. Going down? I really have to question the elevators in this place. It's built so oddly. <laughs> Boom headshot! Well, boom everything. You wanna go? Goodbye. <laughs> Reach for me with that arm and it's coming off. God, I love these weapons. Oh, I need the master key, you fucking whore. Temporarily stuck. Hold on. There we go. I had to respond to him. Let's go kill some more zombies. Love the music in this area. It's so good. Again, this game is just so good. Sure, it may not look the prettiest after fucking 20, yeah, 21 years, but it's still goddamn fun to play. And that's what matters. Cause hey, pretty games aren't the ones that hold up. You know, it's about the content of the game. Like, the reason why Final Fantasies are so, like, the old Final Fantasies are so well remembered is because they had good gameplay and story. And that's why I like a lot of these older games. Because who gives a shit about the aesthetics? As long as the game fucking holds up in gameplay and story wise. That's why I don't care for, like, you know, some of those graphics enthusiasts. It's like, if the game isn't playing at the absolute peak of human limits of visibility, I don't want it. If it ain't playing in 1000 FPS a, a second. If it ain't paying in 1,000 FPS at, I don't know, 16K resolution, I don't want it. Obviously, that's just hyperbole, but I hope people like that. Alright, let's grab ourselves a flamethrower. A flamenwerfer. The Flammenwerfer Hans! <laughs> Actually, he had the split. Get over here. <laughs> bitch, please. Heck off, bitch. Yes, I got the flaming warfer. Ooh, is that the red key already? 
Jesus Christ on a crutch. That's quick. Well, I still need to go all the way down to get the, uh, the part I like. Gotcha, bitch ass. Gotta go all the way down to the lab, activate the guest terminal. Anyway, so hmm, worth worth coming in here though. Definitely worth coming in there to grab that sweet, sweet shotgun shells. And the kick-ass of uh, the liquors. Kick-ass. Why can I not fucking speak today? I should go record my uh, next review after this. It's almost done. Oh. Yeah, kick -ass. How do you like being hit with being covered in... Well... In pain. I don't like it either. Yeah, it fucking hurts, doesn't it? Ah, uh, this, this flame bow is just taking up too much space in my inventory. I don't needs it. I don't needs it, Billy Bob. I think this room has some friendly, friendly liquors, eh? Machine gun. It's the <laughs> Nothing counters liquors quite as effectively as the submachine gun in this game. And I love it. This place has the worst fucking security. How did this place not have a security breach before this point? 
Also, that test is a scary face. I've just noticed that, and that's kind of terrifying. Guest registration's valid for 24 hours. Yay. Now then, kill the giant moth. Let's go kill some zombies. Fuck you, maggots. I killed your daddy. Yeah, another red herb. Nope. We'll use up the weapons box. Of course. Yep. Get out of my inventory now. Hell yes. No zombie? That's what I was looking for. Ah, we have extra magnum rounds. I might as well just pick up a few of you. this back here. Ah, it's the power room key. I did need to come down here. I'm not entirely crazy. I'm just sort of crazy. back up. We don't need to carry this thing around. It's pretty much overkill. For anything but the bosses. God dang it, do I need this too much? Definitely don't need that. physically carry into the final bosses. Not exactly a bad problem to have, but still. We'll go out here, kill a liquor, grab the healing items. hit him. The first bullet makes him stand up. Like, you know, when he's reacting to noise. Uh, and it's all the subsequent bullets that stun lock him to death. Seriously, at this point I have more herbs than I know what to do with. But I'm about to get... Uh, another entire clip of machine gun rounds. So I might as well have fun with this. Actually, I just remembered I want the magnum. Ah, fuck. I actually want the magnum for a bit that's coming up. We're about to deal with uh, another Mr. X attack. And always want to take him down as quick as possible. So I might as well just put up the flamethrower. Sure, it'd be useful for the plant monsters in my way, but I can gun them down with pretty much anything. Bam. 
around and put this up. God damn, that's such a ridiculous amount of health. At this point, I might as well just gun them down with a machine gun and run on past them, them as they die. Oh well, we're almost done with this run. Then maybe we'll start up to Resident Evil 4. Not Resident Evil 3, but that's just because it's a pain in the ass to set up. So we'll jump to four, then we'll, once we beat that, we'll prop, my chair will probably be here and we'll jump to either Code Veronica or three. Probably three, actually. We do need to do three in just two weeks. with the secondary fingerprint verification. Activate. The door is released. Go on in. Let's go. machine gun bullets throughout this entire game. Also, I wonder what got his ass. Like... Like... Legit. I wonder what killed his ass. Good question. I mean, I guess it could be the... Uh, liquors, but unlikely. Considering, uh, I don't think any of the guys died for what's it called? Birkin went on his rampage, so I'm not sure what killed his ass. Maybe he tried to hide in the labs and Birkin got him. Or maybe he was just left behind and rear security. Spawn the corpses. Just because those things, even after death, they can whip you. A light switch, will I push it? Yes. Certainly plenty of magnum rounds. I 
Are they right here as a first aid spray? Or is that a scenario? I know a scenario that could be a first aid spray in here. Yeah, the machine gun, not good for Mr. X, but it is good for, um... Well, liquors. Though, I think we've run out of liquors at this point. There is zombies that'll be in our way, though. So zombies definitely are good for the machine gun. Well, not great, but... Of what's left, I'm pretty sure it's just zombies and bosses. Hell, so there's no point in wasting ammo on, uh... Well, magnum rounds with zombies. Going up. Injured, but this fight with Mr. X should be easy enough. Why does everyone do that? You. You murdered my husband. I know what you're looking for. You came for the Q virus, didn't you? Take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. And come for it. Now, where's that spy you were working with? You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the ancients. The only reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about him. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't know. You're about to die anyway. Hello! I've got the right idea. That went well. They're over resilient though, aren't you, you son of a bitch? Oh, oh well, you failed to get me. Now we can actually make one use of one of these sweet, sweet herbs. Those are for nothing. There we go. That's back up to full. Let's go. pretty quick. Then again, there wasn't much left. We were at the factory when we left off.
Shoot it, Leon. Shoot it, you idiot. Good mistake. You didn't uh, reload your gun Nita. before the fight. Original ship. Uh. Ada. No. Metal Gear and a few others. Fucking haunting. Canonically, Claire locked the door behind her to keep up uh, things from getting uh, Sherry, which is why that save room is locked off for you. Leon, you made it. Claire, is that you? Where are you?
guy. Alright, we all wow, I did pretty good there. I only took one scratch. Three magnum rounds, one rocket, and one scratch. Try regenerating from that, fuck. We have to throw you back in the facility so you go boom. Where? Where am I? It worked. Oh, Sherry, you're gonna be okay. Thanks, Hey, I don't get no it's thanks. I dragged your ass out of that building. I can throw you I back have in. To find my brother. You're right. This is just the beginning. Goes in there, tries to have his little moment. Goodbye, Ada. And then, nope. There was a fucking hatch. Oh, fuck. Dub on a timer. Go, 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 go. Hey, look at all the rope, though I can't speak. God damn it. This is probably one of the cool freakiest monsters in there. Thank you. 
levels that can pose it are destroyed. Which is quite impressive. At least resilience wise. Last cutscene time. Realistically than Claire's ponytail. Then again, back then it was extremely difficult to animate the visual strands of hair. Like, that's one of the reasons why Incredibles almost didn't get made was because Violet's hair was so insane to animate, especially realistically. What are you doing? We have to stop the train right now. What do you think I'm doing? I'm coming away from the giant monster. Come and get me. I'm right here. Ugh. I'll just crawl hmm. out the bottom. Which one's the right switch? Maybe this one? Sherry! Leon! Yeah, the giant red and uh, yellow and black emergency button. That'll do the trick. The Galaxy 5000 has come to a halt. Finally, run! Run! Exit. Are you alright? I'm okay. Where's Claire? Claire? Claire! Right here. Claire! I guess we all made it. They just won't quit. Come on, we have to get out of here. Run! Go, go, go! Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the reason why, like, the early PS3 had so many bald protagonists, was just because people didn't want to deal with trying to fucking animate the hair like that. So, it's finally over. Sherry, you look terrible. No worse than you, Claire. Come on. Time to leave. Now? What's wrong? Is something following us? We have to go. We don't have any time to waste. Let's just go. Where? Hey, it's up to us to take out Umbrella. That ending right there is one of the reasons why I hate the opening of Resident Evil 4. It's like, because Resident Evil 1, 2, 3, and Code Veronica, and hell, even Survivor. They talk about going up, finishing off Umbrella. Resident Evil 4 rolls along. Oh, Umbrella died due to the stock market. Like, what? Fuck you. That's not the satisfying climax we wanted. That's one of the most annoying parts about Resident Evil 4. Is just how much it shit the bed on the ending, you know? Fucked up the conclusion of that whole story. Oh. Every game in the series had built up to a climax at that point. And I was just right out the window. Got sh shit the bed. That's all good, medic. You got good timing, don't you? Literally an hour late, right at the end of the, uh, end of the game. It's okay. Uh, I know what we'll do. We'll do Leon A. First, I'm gonna hit the bathroom after these credits and I see my score. 
How you doing today, medic? thumbnails I've I enslaved you for now nah, I'm fucking with you hell yeah Leon B under three hours one save nice a rank sure send me a preview that's good right there Bow, now, now, now. Do I unlock anything or no? Nah, do I just get fucked? I don't need to do that. I already have the save data. Hey, American Senpai. Good to see you here again. Yeah, I don't need to make another save. I already have Hunk, Tofu, well, not Tofu, Hunk and uh, Extreme Battle already unlocked. Ten days. I'll be right. Medic, just send it to me on Discord or Facebook. I'm not, I'm watching the chat on my phone. So, be right back. And we're back. Oh, fuck, my back hurts. Alright, let's see what Medic just sent me. Ah, not bad. Is that the linear launcher? Hey, I'm sorry you had to send it on Facebook. Or Discord. Cool. Though you won't ever look as badass as Chris with it. Shots fired. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, I need a... Assigned slots, uh... Maybe alone in the dark, has it? Yeah, probably a lot. <laughs> probably a good idea before we start calling you... Well, your favorite phrase. <laughs> Shit, that was not what I wanted. Put that back as my slot too. <laughs> I'm already cursed. Okay, that's the one I just loaded. Okay, never mind. I guess this one was... I swore I had a... Did I save over my Leon A on accident? Might have done so. Oh no, I found it. I found it. Alright, cat. You wanna whack? I'll give you a whack! Hello. A bizarre incident occurred in the outskirts of an American suburb. City. If you don't know, medics are lolly. That's even worse for him. Him. Call him a lolly. But he's not a cool lolly like Alucard. God, Helsinger Prince is fucking funny. Jolly Wally. Making references to fucking shows. yourself. I didn't know they. I didn't know they offered classes for sucking dicks. That's hard. I'll have you know I graduate top my class at sucking dicks. That that's you, medic. Ain't it? Freeze! Shots fired. Ah, uh, that's a little bit. What are you mean. doing here? Well, that is an old ass Hold coffee pasta. I'm a human. I never did get the appeal behind that one. It's just <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Hmm. I want the bullets. <laughs> it originates from a YouTube comment. Do I want the do I want to go for these uh I almost never take the ammo. Fuck it, we'll take it for once. 
Just so I can blast the... Medic, if you do that, I will ruin your relationship. You know what I'll do? I'll tell Leggy on you. That's what I'll do. I'll tell Leggy the entire test. That's right, I'll curse your... I will curse your internet social life forever. If you did do that, I would fucking... Well... What's it called? I will actually hit you with a DMCA strike. It's like, if you drew porn of my character, I would hit you with a DMCA strike. Like, I will copyright sue you into the ground. I'm that sort of asshole. Deserve it. It's like, you know, I take that shit seriously just because of, uh, especially considering the shit that's gone. doesn't work right especially when I have I have a well-established relation uh, well established what's it called uh, hat chain of use <laughs> like I got two years worth of artwork and post backing up it's mine Time to shank these guys. They ain't worth the bullet. That's what I'll do to you, medic. I'll just poke you to death in the head. Nope. Actually, medic, wrong. Once I have a, put an established character out there, Legally speaking, the character is uh, protected under copyright use, under copyright and trademarks. Therefore, you wouldn't actually be able to use it, and I would have legal grounds to uh, sue you. Or at the very least, issue a DC DMCA takedown. Oh. <laughs> I have done a lot of research in this shit just because I've been working with uh, a friend. Come on, get checked. This is what I love. Wow, he just fucking fell down. I wouldn't. Because, honestly, I don't like fucking that shit any. Like, when you make sure of people's characters that don't want it, it's kind of a shame to me. And you and I both know of what I'm talking about, Medic. Well, Builder, it's time for you to get your ass out in the street and make some money. Oh. <laughs> 
She's dead now. <laughs> we all dead. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna let that one live. He could tell the tale of watching all of his friends get stabbed to death slowly from the top of a box. Besides, no one would want to build his body. The last time he thought... I mean, considering both prostitution and pedophilia are both illegal builder, and heavily... Well, heavily illegal, really. Just ain't going my way. Yeah, that wouldn't work. Medic, not medic, builder. There's only like one other nation in the world where prostitution really isn't illegal. That's like New Amsterdam. Though it is legal in Nevada as well. You caused it, medic. Clearly your presence is fucking up everything. Yes, that's N Yes, Builder, that's Nevada. Vegas is in Nevada. That's it, Medic. Because of you, I'm using the infinite ammo machine gun. Everyone dies now. Everyone dies. <laughs> no, it's not. I earned it. Oh, man. Besides, this run is just for fun and kill some time. We already did Who the oh. Claire A, Leon B I needed. I, then I'm, pr tomorrow we'll probably Sorry, do either Resident Evil 3, it looks Code like Veronica, or 4. Has been canceled. What happened? So this stream's just a fun time killer. About two months ago, <sighs> there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other stars members discovered that Umbrella Builder, shut was up. behind everything. That's it, Builder. They risked their lives to reveal the truth. You're getting timed out. But no one believe them oh, I'll just exit. not Can long I after this? that all this I can't I delete the message happen uh, uh, hang in there 
Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Build it. Here, take this key card. I have told you, you be all able to unlock the doors several in the times. This. Now go. Nothing. Don't say a goddamn thing uh, about the remake. Just go. You know, just to be fair, I did it. Uh, Fine, but I'm I did back it. Uh, just hold on. Medic yesterday. I have to do it to you today. Just to be fair, that's. Hey, medic, now, now you can feel a little better that it wasn't just you who got timed out for it. There was no discussing of the mechanics or the story or pretty much any aspect of the remake except the fact that it, exi it exists. Now you can think about what you've done, builder, because you're a bad kid. What I'm about to do to this liquor with this machine gun is what will happen to you next time. Actually, it's a good thing Iceman isn't here because I'm pretty sure he was planning on banning Builder on site. Meh. Talk shit all you want. I already beat the game with almost flawlessly uh, last time. I fucking had, what's it called, like fucking 10 full health items left in the box that I just couldn't do anything with. Get out there and stream your own Red Bull 2 play. Get good, kiddo. true for Resident Evil 2 Paul Haddad it was actually a well still is a professional voice actor and so was Allison Court they just uh hell the uh, I think the main reason why Paul Haddad didn't come back was because he actually developed throat like I remember he actually had throat cancer recently But yeah. Resident Evil 1, it was done like that. Resident Evil 2 had uh, proper voice actors. Hey, American, uh, if you, do you have a Discord or anything? If so, I could link you to a live stream that actually had, they got Paul Haddad to join him to join them on stream uh, and they were uh, playing Resident Evil 2 and he was because he never actually got to see the full game Venomania on Discord uh, I'm gonna need some numbers there mate cuz uh, you know how Discord is Actually, you know what? Oh, hold on. Ah. Here, I'm gonna give you a link to the official Discord. Yes, because we have a channel Discord as well. 
Don't, yeah, yeah, don't you play, you slut. Venomania zero three one two. Okay. Give me one moment to add you on Discord. Always fucking hate dealing with this thing. Always forget how it's done. Venomania. Hashtag bring back Shia LaBeouf. Zero three one two. Okay. Oh yeah, I always forget Discord's really anal about the capitalization. Okay. Ugh. I mean, Medic, there's a reason why I have like 40% disability from the VA, mate. I'm only 21, but fuck. Does it fucking hurt anymore? Nope. Well, I turn 22 next time. <laughs> yep, 21. At least for another three weeks. Maturity aspect. Oh. Now then, let me just grab that link for y'all. Okay, gotta find it. Um, no, that's not what I'm looking for. You know what, fuck it, I'll just go to YouTube, I know where it is. Alright, y'all. You go, and here you go. Oh, God damn! Doesn't help that my back's extra fucking stiff today. 
Okay. There y'all's links are, though. Now then, what do I got here? Nothing good, nothing good. Okay, delete the notifications. And let's get back to killing zombies, shall we? Watched a good chunk of that live stream. Learned some interesting tidbits about uh, how they made Resident Evil 2 and just a little bit about Paul's life. Paul Haddad is my is my favorite version of Leon. Matt Mercer ain't bad, but I just prefer the naive uh, version. I just prefer the naive but good natured cop. You know? We didn't discuss anything actually about the remake. We were talking about about how they didn't have the original voice actors. But they haven't had the original voice actors since Resident Evil 4. Resident Evil 4, Leon was replaced with Matt Mercer. And he's been replaced again if I remember right. But I'm not certain on that one. And Allison Court was replaced in Revelations 2 because of uh, union issues. It's like that isn't Resident Evil 2 remake specific information. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not. Yeah, what happened was the fucking, uh, the, the, no what's it called, the voice actor union was on strike. Episode. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Pretty much. Right. It's like the uh, voice thing. actor's union a was on strike at the time, so they couldn't, so she couldn't fucking, uh, anything join the, she couldn't join the game without violating her fucking union contract. And, well, if she did that, she would lose all of the benefits of being in the union. So, as much as it sucks, it does... How it goes. You know, I'd kind of like to see a Resil 2 behind the scenes of how they did these arms. <laughs> Given the fact you could shoot them, they probably just have the rest of the zombies hidden in that blacked out area. But it'd still be cool. I like that little feature there. 
they just reach through the wall, wall windows trying to pull you through. Oh, that reminds me. If y'all ever played Resident Evil Outbreak, if you fuck up and get caught by the zombie at the beginning of the game, like, there's a zombie that breaks the window and hangs through it trying to pull you out. If you... If you don't break free of it, it can pull you out to your death. Which is fucking hilarious. It's a good game. Especially for a multiplayer game. It's like... It's, it's literally just classic Resident Evil. But with, you know, a multiplayer... But with uh, up to uh, three friends. Yeah, I would fucking love a remake of that. No, you didn't kill me, medic. You just fucking made it difficult for us. Actually, um, uh, American, have you not? Well, uh, well, just as I discussed on my review of the game, you can actually still play it online. So you can still play the game online, mate. All you have to do is get a uh, Japanese PS2 emulator. It's like that's all you need to do is get a Japanese PS2 emulator and a copy of the Japanese ROM. Uh, go to the Outbreak forums, follow their instructions for setting it up, and boom, you're good to go. That's how we still play it online. Basically, the fans brought it back online because they managed to capture some uh, Japanese packets of server information and rebuilt the servers. You're welcome, mate. And hell, that's, that's a game I think everyone should experience if they like Resident Evil. I think it's the ultimate Resident Evil experience, you know? It's classic Resident Evil survival horror with up to four friends, well, up to three friends. And it has some of the most unique enemy variety in the game. Uh, especially if you count Outbreak 2, which... They intended as an expansion, but you couldn't really release an expansion for the PS2 back in the day. So, you know, you had to release as another disc. Kind of like, um, what's it called? Like, I think it's Call of Duty 3 and then, like, Finest Hour or whatever it was. Don't, don't play with Medic. He's an asshole. He will team kill your ass. And that's why I won't play with him again. He's he poisoned the well on that one. Do 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 do. I'm killing it. Yeah, get rid of the pointless ass key. Hey, I wasn't drunk. That was an entirely sober live stream. leg bite and it was successful I'm doing worse than if I just used the regular gun it's funny is 
That's... Uh, well, I did get drunk sad. Where the submachine gun really shines is the liquors and dogs. You just stun lock those shits. Now, now, medic, if I was capable of replacing my blood with vodka and live, don't you think I would have already done it by now? Hell no. I think I'd have to be on a. Is liver dialysis even a thing? I know kidney dialysis is, but. I know blood dialysis is a thing as well, but... Did you do that with the liver? That's a good question. Also, Cocktail just sent me a message. I better give uh, Venomania his rolls. There you go. You got, you got a flock member roll now. You can be a burb. Yeah, if I was... You know what would be an interesting disease to have? That auto brewery syndrome. It basically causes you to get drunk if you eat breads and shit. Because it converts the starch in the bread into, into alcohol. If I had that, I would fucking... At the very least, I wouldn't have to worry about being sober again. You want a drunk stream? Okay, let me eat this bread. Oh, nom 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 nom. Well, that'd be nice too. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Yeah, that would be nice. Yeah, instead of buying a bottle of alcohol, buy a couple loaves of bread. Alright, guys, we're gonna get real fucked up today. 100 bits, I eat two slices of bread. People will think it's a joke until I get real fucked up. <laughs> and it really wouldn't be uh, clickbait. Because it really is an actual uh, medical condition. It was only recently discovered in the last few years, but yeah. Hi, flaming zombie. Hey, look, it's medic as a zombie. Because he's flaming. Shots fired. There's my team. Also, I definitely wouldn't legally be allowed to drive, though. That would be... <laughs> I'll have to check that out after the stream if I remember to.
got him. Look at all those blood puddles. gun I would need if I plan to complete this run would be the Magnum. Otherwise, the shotguns. Everything else just goes down like that. Although, all the weapons fall off with the machine gun, though. ourselves a few extra zombies shall we a lot of people don't know this exist I wish I was drunk But medics, I can't get drunk because medic won't ever take his gold badge back. Yeah. To be fair, at that point, it's probably more of fan pandering. But, considering what, what we wanted them to do is release 1.5. Hell, imagine, I bet if they had put what remains of 1.5 online and sold it and made sure they made explicitly clear that this isn't a full release game, I bet Resident Evil fans would fucking buy it like hotcakes, you know? Not just using the, the hack, hack job uh, version that people have put together based off of rare demo disc they found. I don't want that. How did that even survive the fire? I don't even know. I got fucked up by burbs. Good. Let the burbs take his flash. Also, if they really would recognize the diehard fans. Don't you think they would have made the game a little closer to, you know, how the diehard fans wanted the game to be, not just adding a little skin? Oh, what the fuck? Riku sent a super to the group. But, eh, it's still a step. As I said, I'm willing to give the game the benefit of the doubt. There's a reason. Now, if this game does turn out to be shitty, it's the last Capcom game I'm buying. They'll go in the same list as EA and uh, Konami and Nintendo. But as it, it doesn't. As I've only seen the initial trailer, i.e., you know, the one that was just a cutscene, was just a cutscene with the rat and shit. Like that, that trailer, that's the only one I've seen. I wanted to keep out, out of that shit. 
Also, yes, I bet most of y'all didn't know. There's a box of shotgun shells hidden there for Leon. I think if there's anything there for Claire, it might be handgun or bolts. Not sure, though. Hell, I only found that out uh, yesterday. Because I was just clicking around there for the hell of it. It's like, oh, hey, have some free shotgun shells. Don't need these, but nice. I'm just... Honestly, at this point, I'm just skeptical of Capcom because... We all know how the last few Resident Evils went. Five, good co-op game, not a great Resident Evil game. It's annoying as fuck to play alone. Shiva! 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 Chris! Chris! Fucking hell, that AI. That AI drive me up a wall. Resident Evil 6, well, we all know how Resident Evil 6, 6 turned out. Resident Evil 7, same problem as 5. It wasn't a, exactly a bad game, but it wasn't a, a, a great Resident Evil game, you know? Not a team work, partner! Partner? Sunshine lollipops. And now that Montage Rumble 4 video will be stuck. sure he's extra dead. <laughs> what sort of place is this? I don't want that shitty ass map. You can keep it, Fox. Now, I will take these drugs. Give me the drugs. Come on. You don't need them, game. Oh, they're all dead. Except for you. No rest for you. Got unlimited ammo. Come on, slutty zombie, Rebecca. Let's grab the 
what's it called? Um, the next plug, we're good. See why I am an adamant believer in the submachine gun versus liquor theory? Just, it just toasts their ass. Like, so many people shit on the submachine gun, but it's like, how many guns in the game could just make a liquor its bitch like that? There's, I mean, I guess there is a couple. The Magnum could do it. Though, it still takes two shots on the enhanced versions. The... Shotguns hit or miss. The acid rounds can do it, but as said, upgraded still takes two shots, and during that second shot period, they can get a clean swipe in on you. But the machine gun just stops them in their tracks. They can't do a goddamn thing about it. Stream's about to come to an end. Uh, we almost got our two hours down. I didn't expect to beat the B scenario so quickly today. But we'll come back with another Resident Evil tomorrow. Maybe three, maybe Code Veronica, maybe four. Probably, if I get, if I find a good, comfortable enough setup, I'll do, uh, three. The main issue right now is just my chair is broken. But I can work around that, but it's just what I'm doing right now. As long as the Bluetooth on my PS4 controller doesn't want to act up. Bounce out of here. I don't remember. It's been a few months since I watched it. to highlight how incompetent that cop was at the B scenario was like you couldn't hold off two zombies with the machine gun I held off five you suck all right Marvin it's time for your retirement ceremony oh did I say ceremony I mean bullet <laughs> Bye, Marvin. Let's see. Open this up. Let's go kill some more zombies. I know what I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna kill these dogs. I can hate dogs. You know, you know what also would have probably been a good idea to play some? Some extreme battle would have been a nice thing to play on stream. Extreme battle could have been a lot of fun. This 
especially uh, Ada's, because Ada has it starts with a submachine gun, and you can pick up a second one and a rocket launcher. And it's just silly. All the ammo. Okay, grab more Healy items, yes. Ah, uh, there's just shotgun shells behind this. Don't need it. Nothing could stand up to the submachine gun. Except for boss monsters. Boss monsters are a different beast. And that's what gets uh, Magnum rounds. Yeah, I should do the puzzle. It'll be smart. Up. Up. Down, down, and up. And I'm pretty sure that's probably the most complex puzzle in the game. Because, let's see, there's the lock push puzzle, there's the statue push puzzle. Would you count the valve section of the game as a puzzle, or just... Yeah, and I'd say that's more just an annoying obstacle. Yoink, this is mine now. Might as well, got it, grab it, it's free. I think I'm gonna wrap this up now. Hope you had a good time. I'll see you tomorrow. We'll play some more Resident Evil. Have a good one.